Hey, what is up, Dobas? My name is BNSF67, and I welcome you guys back to the channel. So, in uh, today's episode, as you can probably read by the title, I'm teaching you guys a tutorial. So, a lot of you guys on my uh, during my streams have been asking me, "How do you get everything on there? You know, how how do you get how do you get the follower goal? How do you how do you get the the newest Doba, the the stream uptime, the the total viewers? You know." How do you get all that? I'm about to show you. So you're going to need two programs. One of them is called SNAZ. And one of them is called Twitch Alerts. We will, tar uh, we will start sorry, with SNAZ. So uh, the link will be in the description to get SNAZ. It's so not a virus, I swear. So let's start SNAZ. And now let's go over to Kronos. You can leave this. This doesn't really mean anything at all. So let's go over to Kronos right here. And let's just do a five minute timer. So let's start the timer. So you want to start the timer. You can have the timer set to whatever number you want. Let's do a 24 hour timer. 20, no, 24 hour. No, 24. Maybe you can't. Wait, can you? 24, 24, 24, 4, 4, 2, 4. Use double digit. Can you not? Maybe you can't go up to 24. What's the highest you can go to? 11. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 20, 3, 24. So it looks like 23 is the highest you can go. Yeah, we're just we're just messing around. So let's just do let's just do that. So 24 hour stream. <laughs> or 23 hours. 23 hour stream. Let's just let's just roll with it. So you once you start it, you will see this up here, right next to it. So what you want to do is you want to copy that, go over, go over back to OBS, go to Source, Add, Text, name it whatever you want. We'll just put uh, Timer, maybe if I can spell Timer. Make it whatever color you want. We'll make it black so you guys can. Uh, no, let's make it yellow. Yeah, bright yellow. Make it uh, change it however you want. Uh, you know, bold, italic size, whatever. So once you're done, go to Use Text from File click it and then paste just like that right there and then click OK and now don't know maybe hopefully you guys can see it right up here you see this right here this timer right here hopefully you guys can see that. <laughs> can you guys see it? I hope so. Well, so yeah, so that is how you get your timer. All right, let's move on to uh, getting this right here. Your uh, your count up timer. We'll just leave that going. Your uh, count up timer. What I'm meaning is my stream up time timer. It is basically the same idea. You click start. It'll start. You know, it'll start counting down. You copy the file. Copy, paste. Uh, text file and then you just let's just go uh, up time up time you know name it whatever let's make it bright yellow again now let's make it cyan there you go do the same thing paste boom and it'll be right up here and as you can see you just count down so that is how you get those now how to get the viewers so let's go over to right here and then so this is where you might have to connect your twitch account so just connect your twitch account and do the same thing start it obviously if you're, if you're offline it'll say you're offline so go to the beginning of it copy add you know go over back to obs text we just put viewers if i can spell viewers i don't care if i spelled it wrong do the same thing customize it paste and boom and obviously mine will say zero because uh, I'm not streaming obviously so that is how you get your stream uptime your uh, countdown and your viewers so now let's move on to getting twitch alerts no not twitch alerts 
the uh, follower scrolls and all that. I just, I'm really out of it. I just did a stream. So we'll see you guys. All right. Now we're, now we're back. So you guys are probably wondering, well, I've looked up Twitch alerts and, uh, you know, I, I can't find it. Maybe we can move that back over here. Yeah, let's, let's just let's just get that out of the way. Let's edit scene. Let's uh, make this a little bit smaller. I'll uh, leave these up there for it. So let's go to the internets. Use whatever you want. <laughs> They'll be there the whole time. So what you want to do is you want to look up Twitch alerts. Look at you know everything, and it should be the first one. So go here. Connect your Twitch account. I believe it might ask you to connect your Twitch account. Go to launch Twitch alerts. You see, connect with Twitch. And then, you know, and then I'll just, I'm already logged in. And there you see, so you get that exact thing right here. Boom. I just streamed, as you can see, 44 minutes ago, an hour ago, you know, three hours ago, you know, so excited. I just did that. So, what you want to do is you want to come down to stream labels and download stream labels that's exactly how you do it so let's get out of that and then you should get this little monkey you will get the monkey get the monkey because who doesn't like a monkey so again you're probably gonna have to connect your twitch account uh, it's been a while since uh, I've done it and I was also going to ask you hey where, where do you want to put all these all these text files so put them in a place that you remember them and you won't lose them and you won't delete them you do not want to delete them it will make a new one every time you reset the session, but just yeah, just in case, do not delete them. I have mine in uh, streaming stuffs, so as you can see, all my text files are right here. So now let's uh, let's move on to. Uh, I'll show you guys. Oh, hello. No, wait. Face cam. Well, hi. Bye. It's not the right one. Sorry, guys. <laughs> You saw me for a second. So let's move on to the follower goal. You're like, how do you get the follower goal? Well, I'll show you that. So once you've done anything, go to settings, go down to follower, and then total follower count. And you will see this is the file name. So this is where you will find the file. You know, well, this is the file of it. And then mine is, and then this is how you set up what it's going to look like on stream. So obviously mine's this follower goal. And then, so you, you have to keep this in order to keep the count going. You know, it's count. It's a token. You know, you have to you have to have that. So you guys are probably well. How do you get out of five? Easy. Slash five. That's it. That's it. So you guys are probably saying, well, will it always say seven out of five? It will not. So it, that is just a preview. That is what it will look like. Uh, and obviously you can change it to any, you know, out of a hundred, out of a million, you know, you can have it out of anything. I just have mine out of five because it's very, it's a very small follower count for each stream. Uh, five, five per stream, that's not too bad. So that is how you do it, exactly. And then, you know, uh, I'm not going to save it because I already have mine. So you guys are probably wondering, well, how do you, how do you uh, get to it, you know? So go back over to here. It's basically the same thing to add the timers. So you just go add text and we'll just call it uh, goal make it whatever you want make it yellow again and then go over to here and you can't copy it unless you remember it so go to browse and then find your uh, session follower goals or session follower count right here open and save and we'll go up here see and it'll say zero out of five See, just like that. We'll put that over here in the nice little corner. So let's move on to um, the how do we get the newest Dova right here? It's the newest Dova. So we'll show you that. So it's, it's basically the same thing. Go to settings, go to here, go to the most recent follower. Again, same thing. Just edit whatever you know. It could be newest Dova. We can't use newest Dova because I'm I'm the Dovas. <laughs> uh, it could be your bad mamma jamma. Uh, anybody, you know, newest, newest sugar mom, it could be whatever you want. Again, this is where it's going to be, this is the file name, and this is what it's going to look like. So, newest Dova fish sticks, lol. So, let's go over to OBS, add text, we'll just call it newest 
We'll go over here, do the same exact thing, and let's make it, we can make it white. No, uh, let's make it pink. What well, man doesn't like pink? Again, browse. And then it is the session, no, it's most recent follower, sorry. Most recent follower. And then bing. And then now, whoa, that's hella big. And uh, this is my latest follower who followed me today, so I uh, thank him for following. And so you see that. Boom. Now, now you guys is probably saying, well, how do you get the, how do you get the, the scroll? Same thing over here. Follower, session followers, right here. And this is where it's going to be at. This is the format it's going to be. It's going to be as a list. And I don't think you can have anything else. I'm not sure. Item separator. I don't have any item separator. So as the file format to have mine, I put space the token comma so that's what it's going to look like always you know and so let's close that so let's go to add text just call it scroll scroll hmm cyan no green yeah and then go to browse and then go find the s's and then you go session and follower account and then to have it scrolling, my, my scroll speed is set at 75. And then to be able to get it to scroll, to have a certain length that you want, put it there. You know, uh, use custom text extents. Click that box. And then uh, you can edit whatever. So that's what it's going to look like. So let's enlarge this a little bit. Oh, 75 is really fast. Oh, it's really fast. <laughs> Damn, that's fast. Okay, maybe, maybe, maybe not. That's 77. No, 75. 30, 50. Let's put it at 50. That's huge. Why is this so big? There we go. Much better. Much better. Well, I didn't copy, did I? Hold on, no, that's wrong. Browse. Wait, what did I put? <laughs> um, it's session follower account, isn't it? Or session follower, sorry. Session count, you jackass. <laughs> oh, yeah. And then edit. Um, mine won't show anything because I don't have any... Um, followers at the moment. I don't have any new ones. Um, they will start scrolling once you get a follower. So let's just kind of edit it a little bit. We're just going to put it there. And uh, you can have certain lengths to it. Just move that kind of out of the way. Let's move, no, far from move that out of the little box there just so you can see it. Uh, I see you go back to properties and then you go over to where it says here if you notice ever so slightly, we may not be able to notice it now. Can you notice it? No, it doesn't really seem like it. That's weird. Okay, let's move it over here. Propertas. So, right there. You can see this little green line right there. Right here. The green line right here. You see it moving? So that is how far your text is going to scroll. And then you can edit. Um, so this way, this one, goes how far to the right it will go. This one is how far, I think, down it will scroll. And so that's pretty much it. Um, there's nothing much else to say. Let's go back to here. So that is how you get everything. That's how you get the... Uh, <laughs> that is how you get the the total viewers, the stream up time, the newest Doba, or the newest follower in your cases, the follower goal, and then the scroll of every follower, and also how I get my timer. So I really hope you guys have enjoyed. Rating would be very much appreciated. Rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, follow me on Twitter, obviously. Uh, follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Twitch so you can see when I live stream, so you can see the stuff in real time. <laughs> so, yeah. Really hope you guys have enjoyed. And this has been as of 67.
Signing off. Until next time.